Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Derek and today we're opening up some Pokemon cards. Now you guys may have watched my last video where I talked about a reboot of the channel. That is still true, but I did say we'll still have Pokemon unboxings on this channel, but that won't be entirely the main main focus, even though there will be plenty of it. It just won't be the main main focus, but I'm pretty excited because I have two two videos for you guys this week and we're going to be opening up the new Japanese set Fusion Strike hopefully we can get an awesome Mew card which I don't know if you guys seen some of the stuff in the set pretty pretty cool stuff so far I mean it's not the best set in the world in terms of collectivity but it's got some nice things in it mainly the Mew let's just be honest that's mainly what everybody wants I want to go ahead and say thank you so much for um, the kind words that everybody has been giving me on the channel. I definitely appreciate it. Um, I'm going to continue making content. I'm going to try to start making some more content with some new games coming out. We had some news on the new Pokemon games this week. Actually, it was today for Brilliant Diamond and Shiny Pearl. And uh, yeah, I'm pretty excited for it. But you're not here to hear me ramble. You're here to see the meat of this video and that's opening up Pokemon cards so let's get into it all right let's do this let's do this I'm actually pretty excited kind of nervous too and I shouldn't be I really shouldn't be nervous but I am I I usually don't get too nervous when making any videos but today I kind of am it maybe because it's the first video after the announced reboot of the channel um, I'm pretty excited about it pretty excited to get things started you know, we got a big video game season coming out. Uh, big hitters like Far Cry 6 is actually beginning of October. I'm trying to get all the Pokemon cards out. They're just not happening. There we go. I should... Yeah, there we go. Pokemon cards! And this is for the next video. Usually I try to get two of them. But let's go ahead and get started. Maybe, 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 maybe... Maybe, can we do first pack magic? I know, there's always first pack magic, and then there's last pack magic, and then there's not being able to open up Pokemon card pack magic, which, that's usually how it goes. Will we get the first pack, though? And again, if you're not familiar with Japanese packs, you're not guaranteed any rare or anything like that. So let's go ahead and check C here. Looks like we got us a hollow though. Steelix? Holographic rare? Now don't don't hate on me whenever I you know miss, don't know what the Pokemon is name is because I don't know Japanese, obviously. And uh but I love opening up Japanese packs. I do know, know you know a bunch of Pokemon. Uh that, you know, I'm familiar with. You gotta remember, I just got back into Pokemon back in uh, last May during the pandemic. Pretty much when everybody else got into it. Uh, I made... I went ahead and jumped in too. Now, I didn't jump in because I thought I was going to get rich from it. I jumped in because I was really excited for it. Um, I, I watched a lot of Max Muffo. Looks like we got is it Latias or Latios? Latios or Latias? You'll let me know in the comments. That is our holographic rare. Um, I think it's Latio, Latias. I could be wrong. There's this really awesome card. It's I think it's in Cosmic Eclipse. It has both of them as a tag team, and it is beautiful. And I'd love to have that card. One day, one day, when to star me, star you, star you, star you, not star me. Uh, da, da. Butter free. What's up? We're getting all the holographic rares, man. Got a butterfree holographic rare. Three packs, three holographics. Is that right? Is that is that three packs already? God, I don't know. I don't know. Are you guys opening up any of this, or are you just waiting for the English version? Which I know the English version. Which is called Fusion Strike, I believe. What's this one called? Fusion. This one's called Fusion Arts. The English version is called Fusion Strike. And it is going to be the largest Pokemon 
trading card set ever made, apparently. Um, and they've been showing off some of the previews of some of the stuff that's coming with it. It's not going to be just a straight port over. Um, usually, the Japanese sets, um, you get one once a month or so. And the English sets are usually once every three months. But, um, yeah, like, you will be... They just confirmed the, I think it's Espeon or Umbreon. I think it's Espeon. Maybe, maybe. I always get them confused. Looks like we got our first pool, though. All right. Who's it going to be? Me ah! <laughs> okay, I was hoping we'd pull this. Look at that. Mu V. Will we get the any of the alternate art Mews? There's not very many alternate arts in this. I believe it's just the new and um, Greedence. Looks like we got another hit on our hands. There we go. I think it's Greedent. Greedent V Max. There we go. This box is actually pretty damn good so far, and we're not that far into it. I mean, if you want to talk about hits, Technically, a holographic is a hit. So, I mean, I know some people's like, eh, this is boring. I'll take a holographic. Take a holographic rare. I even collect the uh, reverse rares. Um, Japanese really don't have reverse rare. Not really. That I know of. I could be wrong. Uh, now, I do think maybe in Shining Star V or the high-class sets, maybe, um, I don't remember. I, I Actually, I think, I think I'm think i right. I think in the high-class sets, there are reverse hollow rares, but I don't see them that much in regular sets. Uh, usually, if you want a, something like that, we got us another hit, looks like. Who's it going to be? Hoopa V! Hoopa V, I actually wanted this too. I don't think there's a Hoopa V Max, which kind of sucks actually, because there should have been a Hoopa V Max. But I don't think there is. Hopefully we don't blow all of our load on the first few packs, and the rest of them are just junk packs. Would not make for a good video at all. Those that actually opened up this set, we got us another pool. I think it's Bolton V. We did get a Bolton V. Now, there is a Bolton V Max as well. We've already seen Bolton V and things like Shiny Star V. I'm not sure what else Bolton V has been in, but this is a different one. Not the same one we've seen in Shining Star V. Which I think both of them are playable still. I don't think, uh, I, I'm pretty sure they're both playable. There we go. Oh, dude. Okay. I was wanting to get this too, the Deoxys. It's got the Fusion, the Rapid Strike, and Single Strike. That is sweet. Ichigeki and Ringeki. Ringeki. Okay. I'll shut up. I'll shut up. I'm going to embarrass myself. I don't care. I don't care. I don't embarrass myself. I do it all the time. We got, we, uh, me and my fiance, we went out the other day to um, Applebee's. Those who don't know, I had a, a surgery last year where they reduced the size of my stomach. And I don't drink much. I used to drink a lot. Now, when I was in college and a little bit afterwards, I used to drink quite a bit. And I haven't really drank that much since I had the actual surgery, which is, you know, it's probably a good thing. I do have bottles of alcohol that, you know, uh, <laughs> I own. I own some nice bottles of alcohol, um, it, but I'm not saying, you know, we got us another Obstagoon Hollow Rare? I feel like we've seen a lot of Obstagoon. Maybe it's just me. Maybe maybe it's because I opened up so much fucking Champion's Path that it just... Sorry. Sorry I dropped the F-bomb here. 
You guys don't even understand. Actually, you probably would. If you actually went back on some of my videos, you will see where I first really started. I went crazy. I went crazy with buying ETBs. I was buying up all the uh, Champions Fast ETBs and just to get a Charizard. Now, I did end up pulling both Charizards. I actually pulled one twice. Um, which is pretty cool, which I don't think I put that on video. I may have. I may have. I don't remember if I did or not. Um, one is for sure uh, in this during the, the early stages of the Pokemon uh, content. That's a pretty cool toxicity. Um, yeah, I, I pulled both of them. It was pretty cool. I finally pulled the Charizard from Shiny Star V as well, which was pretty cool. I don't think we're going to pull... There we go. It's not Galated. What, what's the name? Damn, just let me know in the comments. I, I'm pretty sure I... I yeah. <laughs> I, pro I don't know. I forget the name. I know it's probably... Like... You know, the English, obviously, I'm like, oh, yeah, it's that Pokemon. In Japanese, I'm like, uh, unless I actually know what that Pokemon is, then, yeah, I usually, I suck at it. I'm not seeing any hits lately. Well, actually, we did. We just got the V-card. Got a V-card, but we haven't got any Secret Rare or another V-Max. Now, we should get two V-Max... At least in one secret rare in the Japanese uh, booster boxes. Um, that has been my uh, experience with them. And I've opened up a bunch of Japanese sets. Um, so I, I think I kind of know how it's going to work. Now we got a Starmie holographic rare. Nice pulls for all the holographics. We'll go find in the binder. What's our next card? Will it be our secret rare? Will it be an alternate art? Please let it be a Mew alternate art. Here we go. Got a VMAX. There we go. Mew VMAX. There we go. That's what you want. That's what you want, man. You want the Mew VMAX. You want the Mew V. Let's, let's, let's kind of, let's move things around here. I know what you're thinking. Why aren't you using sleeves? I never use sleeves. I never do. I immediately put these in my binder. And I know that having sleeves will increase the worth, the value, which I don't, I'm not in it for just the value of the cards. I'm in it to collect. That's what I like to do. I like opening up Pokemon cards. I like to look in my binders. I like to share my love for Pokemon cards with friends I have or my nephew and niece. They they, they like Pokemon as we got us a hit, by the way. Uh, but we don't know. Chandelure V. This is our secret rare. That is our ultra, not ultra art. It is a full art Chandelure V. It's actually really pretty. Kind of disappointed though that wasn't a Mew, but can't have them all. I think we have one more pack after this, so we may end up on last pack magic. I don't know, but there's always that next box. Jinx, Totodile, Metapod, Bell, and that one. I don't, I don't remember. Two packs. I'm sorry. There was two packs left. Two packs. Will we, will we do good on these? Will we? That's hard to tell. Hard to tell now. All right, last pack, magic. Please, please, give me something. Give me something, just to, just to end on. Just, it doesn't have to be anything wild. It just has to be something at least. Okay, for Alligator Holographic. All right, let's take a look at our pulls. Got us Awesome Chandelure, V, Mew V Max. 
Not Gallade. Bolton V. Hoopa V. Greedent V Max. Mew V. And here's our holographics. I can almost name all of these. Pretty much, I should have just named them all. I don't know why I didn't. Don't know why I didn't. So, I got pretty much exactly what I wanted. I got the Mu V, I got the Mu V Max, I got a Hoopa V, and eh, Chandelure V was one of those cards I really wanted, at least the full art. Now, guys, I want to thank you so much for watching this. I definitely appreciate it. Um, next video we'll have for the unboxing, and I am out of words because I just can't come up with the words. <laughs> Sorry. We'll have another video here soon. I really appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. Um, and again, for everybody that's said kind words or offered any type of suggestions for the channel, I appreciate you very much. Uh, there's going to be some changes on the channel. And some of them, we're going to, I'm not going to bring up my issues uh, when it comes to my problems. Now, I will talk about mental health. Um, and there might be times where I might bring something up, but I don't want it to be about me. This is not just about me. This is about you guys and the enjoyment of Pokemon, video games, movies, um, and anything, really. We will have some, if you guys want, I will do some life vlogs where we'll talk about things that's in, going on. You know, i got a big year next year with me and the, my fiance. You know, we're looking to buy a house. We're getting married and all kinds of stuff so i'm pretty excited but guys thank you so much feel free to hit that follow button hit that subscribe button i'll see you soon